Hello everyone, this is the Underdog, aka the German Viking, and today I wanted to cover the uh, the banning of Alex Jones, Wiley Annapolis, and others from uh, Instagram and Facebook. So, I actually wanted to see uh, to, uh, what actually these uh, these lefties, these SJWs are saying about this. So, I'm going to read and comment on a Mary Sue article. Uh, written by Chelsea Steiner. So, Instagram and Facebook ban uh, Alex Jones, Infowars, and a host of other alt-right trash bags. Well, that's not, uh, that's not very, uh, objective of you, is it now? No, not at all. Where is, uh, the ethical approach to this? Well, I don't see this, uh, even in the headlines. So, what do Alex Jones, Infowars, and Milo Yiannopoulos, Paul Joseph Watson, Laura Luma, Paul Nealon, uh, and Louis Farrakhan have in common? Uh, besides residing in our collective nightmares, these mouthpieces of hideous racist, misogynist, anti-Semitic, and downright dangerous extremist rhetoric have all been banned from Facebook and Instagram. Oh, wow. Okay, first of all, Milo is a Jew. Yeah, that, uh, that's... Uh, it doesn't apply to him now, does it? And now those are quite a mouthful of accusations, but but I'm sure they're they're gonna prove this, in in the article. It's just not accusations and and uh, pejoratives they use in uh, in this article just to um ju just to accuse them for the sake of uh, accusing them because they hold opinions they don't like. So. The move comes after a company, the company's announcement in March that they would be taking progressive steps against white nationalism and white supremacy. So, that doesn't make any sense. Milo is a Jew. How, how is he white supremacist? How is Louis Far Farrakhan a white supremacist? He's black. Okay. That doesn't make any sense. Those listed above were banned for violating uh, Facebook's uh, policy against dangerous individuals and organizations. Farrakhan, while not a member of the alt right, <laughs> is being banned for his anti Semitic rhetoric. <laughs> well, I guess uh, the left hates him as well, even though they've praised him on numerous of occasions. Uh, Facebook released a statement saying we've all oh, we've always banned individuals or organizations that promote or engage in violence or and hate, regardless of ideology. Well, I got uh, banned for thirty days for uh, actually stating facts on Facebook, but that's apparently hate. So. Uh, the process for evaluating for potential violators is extensive, and it w is what led us to our decision to remove these accounts today. Yeah, because you don't have a vague uh, definition of hate or, or, or your own policies at all. No, you don't. Lifetime bans uh, include not only the, the personal accounts, but also any fan pages or groups pages supporting the individuals. I mean... How how can you uh, uh, claim you're a free speech platform uh, and go in Congress and claim you you uh, protect free speech and then do this? I mean, you're you're lying douchebags. Mark Zuckerberg is is such a lying piece of garbage. Jones's conspiracy site Infowars will not only be banned, but any account sharing Infowars content will see their postings removed. Uh, but you are also uh, conspiracy theorists. I mean, uh, how, how about everyone with uh, Russian collusion and uh, other uh, instances of uh, delusional uh, po uh, conspiracy theories? I mean, you, you post uh, stuff all the time on your website which are clearly false and uh, full of conspiracies. Facebook joins Twitter, Apple, and YouTube in its Infowars uh, blackout. Infowars and Alex Jones, in addition to speaking vitriol like hate speech, a uh, citation needed. So, what is hate speech? Huh, Marisu? What is hate speech? Promoted the hideous lie that the Sandy Hood shooting was a false flag. Oh my god. He, oh my god, how many times has he gone on to say that he believes Sandy Hook uh, uh, happened? I mean, th th this is a lie right here. This is a conspiracy. You haven't done one uh, one uh, inch of research, uh, or one minute of e research, I, sh I should rather uh, claim, uh, in regards to Alex Jones. Uh, which resulted in grieving parents being harassed online by Jones' deranged followers. So it's his fault. So it's guilt by association. 
So he has to take responsibility of what others do. That makes no sense. Said parents are no part of a class action lawsuit against uh, Jones and Infowars. Uh, social media sites like Facebook have long been too lenient and, uh, when it comes to hate speech. Wow. You're really gonna do that claim. So, it's never enough with these people. Let's just uh, uh, ban all speech. It's not gonna bite you in the ass uh, uh, at all. Let's just... Uh, uh, more censorship, the better. The more censorship, the better. The, the, this is just unbelievable from the Marisu. That uh, they're advocating for more censorship. It's unbelievable. Unbelievable. Hiding behind the First Amendment. Yeah... That's what free speech is. Um, how can you contra uh, contradict yourself when you s want to uh, say that the social media sites like Facebook have been uh, too lenient and then uh, hi they hide behind the First Amendment? Are you serious right now? <laughs> oh my god. Uh, and both sides sim, um, but with uh, the increase in domestic and international uh, terrorism committed. Yeah, who, who is committing? Most of the, the that terrorism, you don't mention uh, Sri Lanka a lot, which uh, uh, was over twice as many killed than uh, what uh, happened in New Zealand. You don't talk about that, and uh, th you actually go into the de detail with this. Um, international term uh, terrorism committed by dangerous men radicalized on uh, social media. National attention has put uh, these companies under scrutiny. Most notably uh, uh, amongst these attackers were the Christchurch shootings in New Zealand where the killer live streamed his attacks on uh, Facebook. Yeah, but ignore uh, ignore uh, all, the, uh, all the attacks that happened in Africa and uh, ignore all, the, uh, the, all the, the, the attacks in Sri Lanka. Amazing. Amazing, Marisu. You you have selective uh, outrage. Uh, this uh, that's what this is. Uh, Angelo Carusun, president of Media Matters. Yeah, the the cancer that is Media Matters, that uh, have done smear campaigns. Are you serious right now? Sad reality is people are getting killed. Uh, there are mass shootings and mass murders that are clearly being connected to ideas like white genocide, which are fueling radicalization. Citation needed. You have to uh, give us uh, specific examples. The con conditions have changed when you have these massive catalyzing moments that are all connected to real life consequences. It puts pressure on Facebook and others to look in the mirror. Amazing. The spanning is all part of the larger global uh, issues uh, regarding co online extremism, uh, conspiracy theories, and hate speech. Again, define hate speech. And, and uh, hate speech shouldn't be illegal. It shouldn't even be censored. You goddamn idiot. Sorry, I'm, I'm getting frustrated now. It's a widespread issue that ranges from Russian election inter uh, interference. Uh, okay, you're, you're gonna go to anti-vaxxer propaganda to QAnon to Pizzagate. Uh, it's an onslaught of conspiracies disguised as news. Uh, of extremist views disguised as facts. Yeah, that's what you... you, you Mary Sue... The Root, CNN, all of these outlets ha have a hateful uh, uh, rhetoric against, uh, uh, let's say, white males uh, or conservative. Uh, anyone uh, right of Stalin. And uh, that's not uh, uh, views disguised as facts as you uh, proclaim them to be, really. Banning those heinous individuals is merely the tip of the iceberg of ra radical misinformation and extremism. I can uh, do the exact same thing and point the finger at you. Uh, but also, fuck those guys to infinity and beyond. That's very objective. That's very objective. So, that's the garbage article from uh, the Mary Sue. I'm going to put an archive because I don't want to give them clicks. Uh, and this is a garbage article, completely biased, uh, citing media matters. Uh, and not uh, they don't even uh, get quotes from the other side. Anyone uh, that, uh, that makes this balance at all. This is a hit piece. So anyways, thank you guys for watching and see you guys next time. Bye.